this is Cindy Crane the Heart, and I'm back with part two of my Snow and Coco mini series. So the series will end with um, my final project, and I might have a little um, giveaway. So let me go ahead and share some things. The first is I was watching videos by Chris, Christiane, Christiane's Adventures. She showed um, these, which I happen to have. These stamp sets, which when you color them up, they really are, they really go with Snow and Coco really well. And so um, these are all from Hello Bluebird. So I have them, Merry Greeter, Frosty Friends, um, this one, which I can't remember, Little Snowman um, on this one too. And so once you color them up, get all these fun images which you know kind of gives you that snow and cocoa um, feel I love a lot of them because I'm going to use these on other projects all these different snowmen I colored up um, I used my white gel pen very liberally on them which really I think made everything pop once I once I did my white gel pen it was like magic there's all the ones I have left um, in Snow and Cocoa colors that I'm going to be using um, to work on here so I can work on those. But let me go ahead and show you, um, geez, I can't remember where I left off. So I might be repeating something, but I don't think I am. I think I was organized. Okay, so... Um, Go ahead and get going. Okay, so um, I did, I think I might have showed these. These are library double pockets. And I used some of the ephemera. I think that came from the ephemera as well as this one as well. And these are just like library double pockets. And then here is another one. I like that one. They're a little tight though. I hope that they kind of loosen up a little bit. A little tight. Um, and then we have this one. So it's really easy to do. Kind of to loosen it up a little bit. And then um, there we go. Gonna have to stick it in there. All right. And then we've got these, the wood pieces, which for these, I just pleated um, some ribbon, or well, not ribbon, this is like uh, crepe paper. And then I just sewed it, and then I put it on a piece of cardstock so I could put that on very easily. I did the snowflake, I did the snow. And then um, I've got these, right? I did cold and burr. So these are pre-made. I bought these online. And then I just added a silver snowflake. This one has um, an ephemera snowflake there. And then the word cold. And then this one has a silver snowflake and burr. And then I have a puffy sticker here. And then I did a bunch of coffee cups. So I did these coffee cups and these were really fun. I just stamped um, some Christmas sayings and those were some super simple to make. Um, but these are the ones I really wanted to show you guys today. And so I'm using my, I'll go ahead and pull it out for you guys. It's Tim Holtz Alterations. It's this Biggs die. And so this is the one that I use. So it makes a nice size. So I used a variety of things. I used printables. I used um, a few pieces of like ephemera, some cutout pieces from the paper, as well as my um, stamped images. So they're all a variety, a little bit different styles. So like this one right here, this piece is a printable, and then this piece is cut from the paper. 
And then this one is a stamped image from the Hello Bluebird. And then this right here is a puffy sticker. Got stuff popping up on my screen right now. So there's that, which I am very excited about. And then these, this one, this is cut from the paper collection. And then this is a uh, printable pieces, so you can see. And this also is a printable. And this one I cut from the paper collection, and then this one is a printable as well as this piece is cut from the paper. So just trying to make use of all the pieces and they all go together, but they all don't have that it's the same kind of look, which I like. And then this one, these ones are all pieces that I colored from Hello Bluebird. And uh, a stamped image and then ephemera. And then this is one of my stamped images. Stamped image colored in with Copics. And then this one is an ephemera piece. And then this is a snow and cocoa snowflake. And so um, I'm going to be working on probably one more video of probably ephemera, maybe two, but I'm thinking at least one more. And then um, I'll do my final project, possibly. Um, I might make some cards, too. So it's all it's all stuff I'm working on just to see until I get like it's too much snow and cocoa. <laughs> but right now I'm still having a lot of fun being trying to be creative. So thank you for watching. If you missed part one, go back and watch part one um, where I showed some other things that I made. And then this is part two. And so part three hopefully will be coming very soon. Thank you for watching. This is Cindy Craythart.